And one of the things I realized through my 15 years of being a doc here is that you are your best doctor. Self-care is the best form of health care. A doctor only comes in when you need us. And I, the analogy I give is that there's a Himalayan mountain. We are the Sherpa. But the only way you're going to get up that mountain is by you taking one step at a time. And we try to break it, at, break it down into a very simple, easy to understand approach to well-being. And if we look at your food, how and what you're eating, how are you finding time to relax? Are you relaxing? Do you know you have a relaxation response? Are you moving? Are you getting enough exercise? Are you breaking a sweat? How are you sleeping? We find that sleep is a medical necessity, and many of our patients are not getting that restful sleep or enough sleep. It's not so much the quantity, it's the quality of sleep. And I think the last thing is happiness. We all should want to live to get up the next day to do something purposeful. Find meaning, find happiness in your life. And that's really through the lens of positive psychology. T trying to understand why people flourish, why people want to be north of neutral. Just being okay is not good enough. And I think using that kind of model, a fresh model, we can actually address those five pillars of well-being. And if needed, we can actually give medications, prescribe antibiotics, prescribe x-rays, do certain other technologies to be to get a, to get a better sense of your health and well-being